When you have an asset that's trending or in this case is actually in a bullish momentum swing, then you typically tend to see uh, repeatable patterns which are quite interesting. I want to show you what the gold miners ETF, the GDX, uh, has looked like here over the past number of months, uh, particularly since the spring of this year, because we are, as I'm recording this here today, uh, we are seeing a bit of a pullback in shares of the, or the GDX ETF because uh, Newmont Mining, which is a major uh, gold mining stock, is pulling back quite a bit. Interesting though, is as it, re as it comes to the, the pattern uh, that we can see here. So basically what I've found is that over the past, uh, again, number of months, is that every single time that the stock has roughly, uh, not every single time, but on average, I should say, that's a better way of putting it, has overcome its previous high uh, by about five or 6%, only think one time it was a little bit less, uh, it will lead to a pullback. But that pullback ultimately led to a higher low. So here's what I'm what I'm looking at. So we would get higher lows, right, all the way along. And it's, I think this higher low series is not yet over. This is likely, in our view, going to continue. But these pullbacks to higher lows have historically happened since, and I say historically, since April, that's not a lot of history, but you know, uh, in this new up cycle it is, um, when the stock was, or the ETF was breaking uh, or trading above uh, the previous high of about four to 5%. So again, that would be that circle, that would be uh, this circle, uh, that would be this circle, and that would be the latest circle that we just had. The one exception that I found was the marginally only higher higher uh, low in uh, higher high in August where it only traded I don't even know a percent or two above the previous high and then pulled back but this series of essentially higher highs and higher lows is very healthy and is a bullish momentum trade if you want to learn about momentum and how the markets are dictated by machines and momentum join us tomorrow